great. All right, man, that's dark. Um, hey guys, how's it going? Good morning, uh, or evening and afternoon. I'm Ron Burgundy. Good night. Um, sorry. On my way to the flea market, guys. Um, today I I'm about 20 minutes away. It's already 6:40. So um, I didn't want to get up too early, but there was no flea market all week because of rain and weather and all sorts of things. So today's supposed to be semi-warm, even though it's freaking end of January. Oh yeah, my birthday is at the end of uh, next week. So January 31st, yay! Time marches on! <laughs> see what's going on. I think I see Dan. <laughs> Are you? Frozen! First thing I do is film you guys because you're not... Let there. it go, let it go. Kind of frozen. <laughs> you can be. I prefer uh, the other Frozen, the musical. How's your better. hand? Oh, much better. Here you go. So this fucking bat Dan just picked up all these games. All these. Look at this. I didn't do it. Smash. Was this from a storage uh, auction? Yes. Nice. For ten dollars. Ten. Uh, guys, look at all this. Here. Jerk. He's putting it all on uh, eBay or whatever. He won't even let me uh, buy anything. I'll give you twenty bucks for this. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. What do you got there? PC Prime, Romance Two, Captain's uh, Ooh, Super C, Gargoyles Quest, Double Dragon. Wow. What else you got in now? In now. Meh. Uh, King and Queen Bench. Oh, that's like. Oh, Did Dave see that? Yeah. No. Hey, Marshall. How are you doing? All right. Hey, man. Happy belated. <laughs> what? Happy belated. This was the locker the I asked Dave to help me it's with, and belated. he never came to help me. Oh, okay. So. Oh, thanks. Wow. Thank you. Oh man, my neighbor's trying to give me that TV like that. Oh, I'll give you one. I'll drop it off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You say I'm that old. Exactly. Yeah. But all right. Well, dude, that's really good, man. Congrats on that. If you sell it right, that's a couple hundred bucks right there. I'll be 36 now. Like, two. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Baby. We're both babies. Marshall! Hi. <laughs> what should I say? Should I represent? Yeah, represent, man. Talk Coming away. too many games, 2019. It's going to be great. It's you know why? Because I'll brother. be there with that's all right. the great dollar deals. <laughs> that's awesome, man. Dude, I need a hoodie like that. With this one, a Screamway hoodie? Yeah. I'm representing that company. Like... Two less than, uh, you know, like 190. Who are you? Good morning, sir. Ooh, the Captain Crunch piggy bank. Dan, the cat. It's a nice pinup back there. <laughs> uh oh, what's this? What's this feeding frenzy over here? Ooh, dollar. What can you get for a dollar? Hey, Wahoo! Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you guys? <laughs> Not bad, how you been? One dollar over here! Cold. One dollar over here, too. Oh, then they're done that. Yeah. Not, <laughs> nuts to that. That's all you got today, or you're still working on it? I'm a very slow start. All right. <laughs> I'll have uh, this whole table full of dollar stuff. I'm not sure it's going to be all figures and stuff. It might be like movies, CDs, stuff like that. And then I have other stuff coming out. Any Power Rangers? Yeah. Zords? You know. <laughs> nah, no, no swords. Power Rangers? I might have a couple, I'm not really sure. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Did you? Oh, yeah. What's this from, man? Oh, what the hell is that from? It's just cool. Uh, you're like, it's from Dollarland. It's I a dollar. No <laughs> they have some sort of market. Yeah, I do. 2008. Huh. Oh, it's kind of cool, though. Yeah. Is this. Oh, okay. That's yeah, weird, like. Monstery guy. I couldn't tell you on this one. All right. Well, I'm gonna take him because. All right. Because he's. Yeah, I kind of dig him. 
Uh, I don't got to catch them all. Walking around with Dan here, guys. Hi, people, Noitz. Yeah, he's back. I'm always here. <laughs> well, in the walking video, oh. which I like almost don't do with anyone at all. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while. Watch your step. Yeah. Ow! Bright light. Why didn't you tell me? I did. All right. So I got a bunch of boxes. Dan got some for his kids, I think. And uh, uh, Dan, we need to turn around. Yeah, here's some stuff you guys that aren't up early are missing. What we just saw, and this stuff. Genesis, Xbox, PlayStation 2, Wii. 360. 360. Like 50 of 360s. Yeah. 50 much. 360s. <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? What? Let's see what they got. Nice. All right. All right, Dan. Looks like we're too early for everything. Bad pack. Hey, Dan, I'm looking for um, killer cars on VHS if you ever come across it. Yeah, that's like a, you know, car on it with a dude. Typical like 70s, 80s style looking. Just saw that the other day. Some guy on YouTube picked one up. I was like, I gotta see that movie. Yeah, usually, usually. Hey, look, look. Wait, no, am I recording? Was, yes, no, I, I'm recording, no, Don. No. I, I tried to sneak in behind. Maybe if you were in the video, I wouldn't get cut out. <laughs> exactly. I don't watch it anyway. Just, just walk around yeah. behind us. <laughs> Ooh, good, good to know. Yeah, you you missed some Nintendo stuff. Swords. Just got to my phone. Done, done, done. I look, uh, the red, that one is Cops and Crooks Hasbro, uh, Brave Star. Yeah. Uh, I think that's Star Trek. I think that's Star Trek, Playmates, and I'm not yeah. sure. I didn't really see these other ones. Those are the, those are the oh, ones those. to G.I. Joe. Exactly. Um, I couldn't see that. What's that? This is, I, I put this on. Oh, you sure. know what that's to? Yeah, it's Cops and Crooks. No, it's not. Hasbro. Isn't it? Sure. No. S and M whip. No. Oh. Double Dragon. I can swear it's Hasbro. Okay. Well, Double Dragon is Hasbro. Tyco. It's too. It's too small. It's but too small said. for cops and crooks. <laughs> Boy, you misread it, it, and it's sixty-nine. Might be sixty-six. Sixty-six. All right. So they're even. trying to figure it out more. Sixty-nine or that would be fifty-nine. Saying a bunch of numbers that yeah, I don't know Yeah, it's backwards. About. It's either or. Oh yeah, it's Battle Beast. It's sixty-six. He was right. Oh. Took six or 99. Oh, that's a good one. Let's see. Um, 66 belongs to the sloth. Oh, I completed my sloth. Yay, congrats. So nice. Million dollars for it. <laughs> so the current uh, consensus is these are shower curtain things. Went clips. through several theories, but well, that might be the... Uh, well, what's another theory? Um, the lamp holder or something? Put it on like a, like, like a carousel or like something that... Um, another, although it would be weird that you'd have two of each, though. Oh, you know what? It might have been a part of a lamp. That's, that was a theory. That's another one? <laughs> There's also a theory that maybe it went on, um, an antenna, but this, the part at the bottom probably, the hinge would probably interfere with it, so. Well, they look amazing on camera. <laughs> awesome. Fortunately, there was one more Butterfree, but somebody broke it. Ah, uh, of course. So. Here, don't break that one. <laughs> Hi, guys. So, uh, we meet again. Um, just a little preview, I'll show you some things I picked up here while I ran into Naz and uh, stay tuned. Of course, uh, we'll be posting a video later on in the week or maybe just before this video comes out. We got this, don't know what it is. I, I'm assuming it's Playmobil. It just looks like it, but, it, but it's like a giant um, clam. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I actually went piece. scuba diving in Australia and I seen giant clams. And amazing. Wow. Men in black. Very nice. Um, but let's show you some good stuff. Oh, mic? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's awesome. Iron mic right here. Look at that. It's great. Uh, incarcerated, so slightly racist, but <laughs> yeah. we like it. Dude, that's history right there. Yeah, that's true. We got a big bag of dirty toys. So I think what I'm going to do is I might show them and then I'll do it before and after. But how about that guy, huh? Whoa, what's up with that? That's a uh, Universal Monster Ninja Turtle. He's like a glow in the dark turtle? Exactly, yeah. Uh -huh. Awesome, man. Glow in the dark, yeah. I mean, he's filthy. 
He's a bit discolored, but he was a dollar, so. Dude, I've never seen one of those. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, I got this. All right, Star Wars. Yeah, I like, you know, like, because people dress up, so they're quite popular, you know, like, so the stormtroopers, so, and you probably won't get arrested or shot if you have something like that. It's blatantly a prop, so. <laughs> Cars. Oh, have you yeah. seen this? Yeah, I have a, the original release. It was uh, silver. Oh, really? Yeah, uh, I don't know. 88, is it? 88. All right, so yeah, this is still good. All right, we'll it's see. Like, it's some kind of moon rover thing. Yeah, Hot Wheels, that's, that's kind of cool. And um, what can we finish off with? Let's see. Let's pick out. Yeah, you guys see, there's a lot of stuff. It's a little sunny. How about that? We'll yeah. end in the 90s. Form of fuck it. Captain Play. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Very cool. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Please stay tuned. We'll have a longer video. We'll get into depth. I'll show you the accessories and all that. Go to Mike's YouTube channel, One Man's Junk. If you want to see more of his stuff, he has a lot of toys. You guys seen his pickups on my channel. So if you want to see more in depth stuff where he talks about it, gives you a little bit of education, uh, a little bit of knowledge on how to buy stuff, how to resell stuff, you know, stuff like that. So go to this channel for that and uh, keep hanging out with me. I'm still going to go around and do stuff. So thanks, Mike. See you guys. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? <laughs> Mike, you're a vulture, man. You're a vulture. <laughs> How long going to be here for? Um, Come and pick the bag. <laughs> oh, okay. <sighs> Did you get anything special? Like that awesome sealed thing oh, last time? It's the winter desert. Not much out here in the freezing cold. Uh, it's not that cold, Mike. Compared to the rest of the country, it's freezing cold. Oh my god, I think I can do an imitation of bubbles from a uh, trailer park. Oh, come on, Blake! Come on, man! <laughs> Shark, yeah. Mr. Lee, come on! I want to do a cat park! <laughs> Kitty's park! Anyway. The reason I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm in a hurry is because I'm in a hurry. He is like, yeah. they're stupid that's in that like. show. Alright. You can get 10 bucks for that. Maybe. Look at these, look at these reselling scumbags. Resellers. Yeah. Pinky. Pinky, you all. We're only in this for the love of the game. Yes. The love. Oh, hit the player, hit oh, the game. Uh, I was gonna do an, like a really awesome zoom in on your face, but I can't because I have coffee in my hand. Hey guys, look, it's Kevin. Hey, what's up, guys? <laughs> he brought a case of Hot Wheels and Matchbox 164 scale cars. Uh, I'm looking for Mustangs, so I'm gonna dig through this. I'm not gonna put you through the pain of me digging through this. Here, I'll move this a little. That's it. <laughs> right, I'm gonna look through this, see if I can find Mustangs for my project. I'll let you guys know what's up. Yeah, you can. <laughs> what's your, uh, you want to plug any like Facebook or anything? Want people uh, check you out? You sell anywhere, like online? No. All right, cool. All right, well, don't check him out. Come out here and buy from him directly. <laughs> you know that Jamie Farr, he wasn't supposed to be in the whole series. He was only supposed to make, you know, guest appearances and, you know, then a couple, then a few. Then they just kept him and that's why they use him as a transvestite. And, that, no, but that really helped his career, though. Okay. He, yeah. No, seriously, he wasn't supposed to be, in, you know, from the beginning to the end. He was right. supposed to be. In. You know what? I don't care what they say. I like After Mash too. There was a there was a series for two seasons. After Mash was over, where it was Colonel Potter, yeah. um, Klinger, right. and uh, the priest eventually came in. The priest came in, he, uh, and he came to the hospital because he had a bad drinking problem and needed to get back right with God. So he really? started being the the priest for the. All right. Like Father Mulcahy got like a serious drinking problem after the end of. Uh, I'm Dan. I'm using your car. <laughs> Sorry, Dan. He's like, uh, it's a living. Yeah. All right. Um, oh yeah, this is Mike, by the way. Hey guys, you, you see me? <laughs> Another my, Mike. Another little fatter in the face. But, um, yeah, Superman. Boom. Uh, looks like the first volume of Superman. New Krypton. And then I got these cool. Returns prequel books. One, two, three, and four. Nice. All a dollar each. From Mel, I got Hogan's Alley for Nintendo. Ooh, nice. And a Desert Strike for Oh, Dennis. you got that. Yeah, cool. I bought it, yeah. Good price? It's one of my favorite games. Oh, cool. 
Yeah. Did you play the other one? The I played them all. Jungle? Yeah, I played them all. I like those. That's my favorite one. Nice. Got uh, Marvel vs. DC number one. Th this is what caught my eye on his bag. I was like, oh, what yeah, is that? One, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mentioned Superman number whatever, 505. Good cover. You know, and then Superman and Chain number two. Annual Adventures of Superman. There Batman we go. number one million. <laughs> I don't know, you know, Batman the Outsiders. Cool. Superman Prime. The big ass on his chest. Wait, is that another book here? Oh, yeah. Uh, no, no, no. Superman, War of the Superman. Oh. Man of Steel number one, which I was looking for. Awesome. Special Collector's Edition. Is that, is that the best it, one from it, the bunch? It, it just means extra pages. No, <laughs> I'm a Batman. Wait, I got two of them. Holy crap. <laughs> You want Superman and Steel number one? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. If you want, you can have that one. And then uh, Nightwing, Our World, Annual one. And then I got this for my wife. Aw. She likes cats, so. I got Siamese cat figures for my girl. <laughs> Same thing, man. What's with girls? <laughs> then I got, for some reason, my six-year-old son loves these things. Five Nights, at, Five Nights at Freddy. Uh-huh. It's a, based off a game. You know, everything has to be a connect, uh, collect and connect. And then it was interesting. I went over and bought, bought a, bought a bunch of these for a dollar a piece, complete, oh, cool. complete sets of trading cards nice. from the 90s. He had a whole bunch. Piece. He had a whole bunch of them over there. He went ten dollars for the box, but I had most of the trading cards of theirs. And the rest are movies. I only want movies. Nice. All to come to Jersey, back to Jersey, and back to the future too. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, he, he had a lot of awesome stuff. I picked up some toys from him this oh, you morning. Know, you know what I'm talking about? That? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, was, I went to him last night. He had a bunch of Batman books too. Uh, what's his name? Uh, Mel got um, Rocky Horror Pictures uh, deck from him. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, he, he bought the whole box for ten bucks. So I'm like, yeah, I don't need everything for ten bucks. <laughs> exactly. So I'm like, what am I gonna? Trading cards aren't really a thing anymore, so I, I like collecting all the classics. So. Yeah, it's just the feeling by looking at so them. I'm Mike number 10, I think. <laughs> <laughs> well, I used to call you Mike Dino Charge Mike, because that's how we yes, met, kind of. Right, yes. But uh, yeah, I don't know if that's going to stick. And you know my friend Drew, Drew Epstein. That's right, yeah. Yeah, he, I've seen him in a couple of your videos hanging out. Yeah, so. Drew, oh my yeah, god. So. Awesome. Hey, thanks for showing your stuff. No, no problem. Woohoo. Ooh, customers. <laughs> All right, it's uh, lunch time for me. I'm back at Mike's. Love that spot. Again, you see this setup? Go there. Dude, the sandwiches are amazing. And in my opinion, best coffee here. Like, uh, you know, as far as I know. No offense to all the other shops at Columbus, but yeah, this little hidden corner spot that Mel introduced me to. Uh, he actually knows some of the guys in there, so. But yeah, well, it's a cool looking little spot. I'll show you what I'm gonna eat. Oh my god, it's so delicious. Ah, thank you, yeah, sir. Thank you. There's and onions and everything cool. over there, and that green thing. Too. The coffee? Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right, there's my delicious coffee. hot dog with coffee. All right. Ah, oh, there's their setup. All right, cool. Video, I just decided to catch Mike and his normal activities at the flea market. This is what he does. That's scary. <laughs> yeah, right? Where did the get the Yeah, that's a nice weapon. They're probably vintage collectors. What was the battle for the Planet of the Apes? The guys are wearing a Nazi helmet in the cars. It's all like 60s out. Oh my god. They're underground for whatever. <laughs> Oh yeah! The instructions. American yeah, it comes Beauty with the man. control sticks, that otherwise bag. known as bats. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a mustache? Oh no, that's a capture. Oh, that's capture man. Okay, I was like, why? <laughs> Doctor Zeus's is mustache. Take that, bright eyes. <laughs> I can talk. I can talk. I can sing. They, they all laughed at that joke, just saying. Uh, Smell lurking behind Mike. Is Amigo going to remake the uh, Planet of the Ape Treehouse now? Because the Amigos are back out? Uh, Diamond Select has them. I don't know if they're going to... It's missing the crow's nest part. <sighs> that's cool though. What would you say, a dollar? That was eight. Okay, that's still good. That's like two gallons of gas. Well, I think when it was new, it was like $12. Oh, really? 
which was a lot of money because I remember the GI Joe mobile support vehicle was just 16 bucks, and that was like you know 220 bucks back then. Yeah. You're not getting that for 16 dollars. Just for inflation. Yeah. <sighs> all right. Well, is that all you got today, Mike? Toys R Us exclusive. Oh, cool. All right. I got it for 10 It was 5 for each guy. Not bad. That's well, good, I right? Do a, yeah, I want to do a custom. Oh. oh no, Can you share with us if you do it? Yeah. If it comes out good. Right. <laughs> It'll come out good. Uh, Mike's a non-self-proclaimed artist. <laughs> he does awesome dioramas and art stuff. And Damn it, he only does pictures. He doesn't make videos. <laughs> Maybe I'll convince him one day. One day. Googly googly goo. I have it. I just need all the back parts. I was just showing them the, the there's certain guys I'll, I'll collect the whole. Oh, your combiners. I'll find no. I'll just find like every version of them. Like this is the well, it looks really third good party. When they have the guns. That know? yeah, that one's so cool looking. Yeah. Eh. This one you can get cheap. Yeah. Well, these are ones what do they go for? Uh, no, there's a couple. Five bucks? Anyone that you see that still has the price tag on it. Oh, that's Scott. Scott. Yeah. And then I, I have the like a, the I'm gonna G2. Take the back parts <laughs> you know how long it took me to get those right. friggin' back parts? You know how long it takes you to find? I've got Sunstreaker. I've got all the this, parts. I've never owned a Sunstreaker. This is before they became the Constructicons. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah. Dan got that for me. Well, that's when they were Apprentice Cons. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Before they became Union. This is G2, uh, whatchamacallit, I can't remember that. I got that one off of you. Yeah, yeah, the I gave you a jet. The Megatron, or the, I know I gave you a jet, jet fire. These are the, this is the gun that goes to this guy. I got a bag of nuts. Oh, and my bag of <laughs> You and your nuts, put your nuts away. You know what that's See, true? that's the problem with the, uh, parts. I no. have two. Spider-Man? No, it's Batman. Two third party, you know, uh, uh, um. Yeah, like an original yeah. so bat cave or shelf, something? No. Like to, no. Mike, yeah, once... what does it go to? I don't know. I'm going to say a cake topper. Thank you. Ah, damn, Mike. It came with package with the cake pan. Just because they uh, you make the cake and you put it on the just top. Just the quality of the plastic. That's this cute. guy right here is a... Uh, cake. You recognize him from the movie, the original animated movie? Nope. This is a Springer. No. Nope. Cool. The cool version of Springer. I, I like this much better. He's got the double barrel shotgun thing. Which he didn't have in the movie. <laughs> There's yeah, this, but uh, the toy looks awesome. He, he, he turns, he yeah, turns into a helicopter and the... Is that a Huey, as we call him? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> so that part probably I, falls off. I, I, lie, picked right? this, like, I picked this guy up. No, this actually stays in there pretty good. Uh, the only thing, I lost this on the floor of my bedroom. Oh. Like, With that little two piece. years ago. And when I was moving, I'm like, oh, I'm going to have to buy another one because it's missing the bottom piece. So when I'm cleaning my room to like get, get everything ready for the move, I found that piece. I'm like, oh crap, clicked it right on there. Nice. Like, there we go. Where was it? It was just, my, my floor was like a hoarder's. Oh, it was right. just like, <laughs> because I didn't have any, I, I didn't have anywhere to store anything. So everything was in bins in my room. And there was like just a little bit of debris in between the bins, you know, and that's where, but I got this guy at Rue 70 Flea Market. Uh, really? When was that? Because they don't crap th there now. Three or four years ago yeah, for a dollar. That's amazing. I used to go there all the time. It had the instru his instructions are floating around somewhere too. But it's like the, you know. Yeah, that's a cool one. I would pick that one up. Yeah. Just because of the head. I like the heads on some of them. It's a beautiful sculpture. I only have yeah, this beard. guy's just, the colors are so pleasing. Yeah, that <laughs> Did that sound weird? Sorry. Rock'em Sock. Yeah, I saw that guy. Yeah, he's carrying it around. These are Starscream's weapons for the original Starscream. Nice. But Dan bought the, the Power Master off of the guy. And I bought the rest of the robot. I like the robot more than I don't really care that that's not in there. Right, right, right. Hey, how you doing? Oh, uh, SpongeBob for GameCube? Oh, this guy's like in every bin. <laughs> Man. You can look, just be gentle. Yeah, yeah. Who's who's this yellow guy? Uh, which one? That's a beach or a sandstorm. Nice. He's cool looking too. I've never seen this like line in the yeah, stores. No, like, no, what's no, the year know. on these? No, I don't show this stuff They're almost like crossed no, with Gundam. Is this one? Uh, these are uh, from a couple years ago, right? Oh, really? uh, three bucks. The Titans Return. Okay, you know, yeah. A couple years ago already. But they're, they're neat, but like yeah. that's just cool. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know who he did, what he does, who he is. He's just cool toy. Inside there, or? 
Maybe. Yeah. Something's got to go in there. All right. Like the human uh, cyborg. <laughs> oh, that was mouse stuff. I yeah, will, this is my personal private stuff. I will not show stuff. up on this video, correct? Oh, you're you're all over this video, man, and your bag of nuts. See this guy. <laughs> Damn, nut go bag. Bag of nuts. This guy and this guy are part of the same robot. Yeah, we're Stop. talking about nuts. <laughs> not, I'm not... in my nuts. <laughs> is that sea spray? No, no. This is um, <laughs> forget what the hell he's called, but I gotta be what really, got really there? careful with him because I already broke. Oh no. The plastic's very delicate on this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Close that bin up, man. <laughs> No, don't forget that. Can't wait to put these on the on the shelf when I. Oh. I got why well, I, I got a good start. I got these and I got the masterpieces like the big the big guys. Yeah. I got that that beautiful side the Lamborghini side swipe. Yeah, I know you like and that I one a lot. The, the I got the version two of them where it's the black Lamborghini and he's got spiked wheels on it for shoulder blades. Oh, nice. And, nice. and he's got a sword and. Yeah, it's like a Thunderdome <laughs> looking yeah, guy. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, dude, if you come across another one of these, like pick it up for me. Yeah, I'll pick it up for you. Sweet. I just like. I, I got that from Scott for like uh, ten dollars. Are they worth more than that? They, 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 like 15, if you get 20. them in a the box, that's where they're worth something. Loose. Yeah, I don't even. Who cares about the box? I'm not reselling them. <laughs> Two more years. This is this will probably be gone for like 60, 70 bucks. Nice. Yeah. It's just with these, it's like you gotta just put the time in and wait. That's what I told her. I said eventually, like. When the time comes for me to get a new car or something, yeah, I'll be able to take all the stuff I, you know, on the shelf if I decide I want to get rid of it. Yeah. Well, there's only one I can't get rid of, and that's uh, that other Malcross Valkyrie. Okay. The blue one that yeah. I found for like 15 bucks out here that's worth 400 bucks. The one in box. Yeah, I promised that to Mike. Okay. <laughs> well, Mike also gets it if I die. So. Oh my God, that's a commitment there. Oh. Hey, it, it, it was one of those things where, you, you know, we're not going to come across it again. So. Oh, for sure. But yeah, there's your Mel tip of the day. Be patient. Put it away. You'll make money on it later. Some things. Or you won't. But at least you'll have them. I don't know enough about them. I want Mike playing with stuff now. That's a Sky Warp, I think. He's missing a lot, but he's kind of cool. I wish this car would go down. I think it's supposed to. Probably fused. Yeah. It'd be better at that one. Yeah. With the weather as cold as it is, I'd be careful trying to move. Exactly. I don't think it's. I don't think it moves. No, but I did see one piece. See what time To be is continued. It. Yeah, we saw that for five. No, I didn't see that. I saw that this morning, but I didn't have any yeah. extra money to. Nobody wants it. I mean, it's actually like. It's <laughs> kind of nice. That's why I sat there forever. Keep I'm bumming everybody out. <laughs> no, if, if you like, to be if honest, you like Fable. I'm not going to buy every stupid little goddamn thing ever made. Oh, if you like Fable 3. Ooh. It's not like I'm wasting money on my... Uh, yeah, clean that up. Yeah, yeah, got, yeah, yeah. Oh, Eric will love this. Eric, I got something. Uh-oh, Eric. Uh, Eric's like, yeah, I'm showing this. Hold on. <laughs> no, that's that's junk. This is of what course. it's all about. Oh, this you're going to laugh when you see this. No, you're going to love this. Oh, you're going to no. ovulate over... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know, yeah. <laughs> he got you beat, man. Eric's like, okay, yeah, okay. Eric, this will send you to the moon. Pro I, looks like it might kill me from like the looks. It of will. It. Hey, what do you think Michael Jackson happened to is, him? Is that an American product or? Oddly enough, it's, it's white chocolate. It's chocolate um, fondue. Are you kidding? But me? it's it's Swiss. That's so. disturbing. It's white chocolate. Uh, white well, chocolate. All right. Well, <laughs> it's vitiligo chocolate. All right. Leave it alone. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And then over time, it turned into white chocolate. <laughs> well, that, yeah. Well, chocolate blue. And then it died. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. We That's saw cool. this last week. I was thinking about getting one, but I, I don't have any room. If I take it home, I'll get in trouble. Revovan. Nice. I remember like 10 years ago, this guy was so boxing out, 20 of them. Well, because I looked it up, and it turns out like like a pre-owned one sold for like 20 bucks. So. Yeah, there's huh. so That's like a $40 thing? Yeah, probably. So you bought Ooh, two yeah, what's that Star Trek oh. thing? That looks cool. No, it's a coloring book. Oh. That's not from Perry. That's not colored. So. Very nice. Well, now you got something to do. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. What's, um... 
um, the cardboard thing. Uh oh. Disney stamps from different countries. Oh, cool. Yeah, I have some of these in my childhood collection. Oh, none from uh, Ukraine. I guess they couldn't afford it. <laughs> See, this is from the. Um, the. Um, Where are rabbits? The Song uh, of the South. The Song of the one. South. Okay. This one, this one, this one. I had these small oh, actually, this Mowgli row. ones. Imperial? I had all these. Or Imperial, no, not Imperial. Ideal put out a. That's a yeah, good this find. Is the, Years ago. Yeah. Oh, see? That's, that's why Turks and Caicos. Because in America, the so Disney the locked that in the vault. They consider the they consider that racist. Yeah, that be sure oh, the, the the um Mike. Song of the South. Yeah, yeah. That's oh, why I was so happy to find the. If you watch it, it's a product of the year it was made. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's it, this whole thing with, uh, I mean, I I know you have to be sensitive, to, but it, but put a warning on it, and then you put it back out. The people that were around then that want to watch it again, yeah. they can sit there and watch it. If you think it's if you think it's racist or it's insensitive to a certain group, put a warning on there that this was made in the 1930s. You know, like Warner Brothers did. They had uh, Whoopi Goldberg come out in the beginning of the yeah, yeah. the uh, Looney Tunes cartoons and say, "Hey, these are you know they made these back in the day." Yeah, you're gonna see some stuff that you're not gonna like. You know. Oh, that's cool, Charlie that's Daniels Band. One of those bubblegum records. Bubblegum records. <laughs> <laughs> that's cool right there. I. It, it might be broken because I think it's shaking. That's oh, right. no, I'm sorry. Moonwalker Candy is better than Charlie Daniels. Nah, nah. I'm, uh, I'm sorry. Charlie, Devil went down to Georgia on Bubblegum. That's the only song anybody fucking knows. <laughs> what? Long Devil haired went in, No, that's long -haired it. Hippie. the first one. Just no, heads up for anyone who's about to complain. This is an 18-plus channel. So if you're watching this with your kids, once in a while, somebody might curse. Sorry, guys. <laughs> um, the Legend of Wooly Swamp. Game of Thrones? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> It's a 30 by 50 diamond. Holy crap. <laughs> if you ever go back to the woolly swamp, it's best Mike, you look like me home. now. <laughs> There's things out there in the middle of those woods making a young man die from fright. And a random bag of magic fruits. There's things that walk and things that talk and things that creep around on the ground. And they say the ghost of Lucius Clay gets up and he walks around. But I couldn't believe it. I just had to find that for myself. And I couldn't conceive it. I never would listen to nobody else. Yeah, just, just some things from, you can't explain. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Captain, you, you and the claim. timer counts down to zero and a porthole opens. Don't go through it. <laughs> did you get that in uh, Bed Bath & Beyond, the Beyond department? Doesn't smell like it. Doesn't smell like it. <laughs> <laughs> what, Bed Bath & Beyond? Yeah, I said, did you get that in the Beyond department? Like, uh, what's his name? The movie. The sliders. No. Um... Christopher Walken's in the Beyond Department at Bed Bath and Beyond, and uh, what's his name? Adam Sandler stars in the movie. Click. Oh, I didn't see that movie. Right, click. That's it. Yeah. Click like two minutes before him. I don't know. <laughs> Not good enough for you. The show I'm referencing is uh, Jerry O'Connell. It's called Sliders. I love that show. Stupidest ending to any series. Yeah, I haven't seen it, but I know what happens. It's awful. You know what's they, actually... Oh, sorry. No, it's okay. The best Universal remotes, if you ever see them, because I see them occasionally, are um, Watch That Harmony. Yeah, I was going to say the Harmony remotes. Nice. Um, I, I, I want to find Another the, tip the, for you guys. I want to find the one, the longer version, not the, the square one. is like, uncomfortable. I'm trying to say out of the I'm kind of like, we have a oh, 700. It's about to wrap it up. Now a little older. You killed my battery, battery Don. Good. One day we were actually... At least I killed yeah. something today. Like eight ninety or something. Yeah. It was still older, but it actually had it had a an RF receiver, so you could control things in other rooms. And it was brand new in the package, so we were like, we don't really need it. So we're like, maybe we'll sell that and buy the one we use. Sold it for two hundred seventy-five. Wow. <laughs> Boom. Because apparently the RF ones are like really valuable. The devil went down to Georgia. He was looking for a soul to steal. Mm -hmm. He was in a bind, because he was way behind, and he was willing to make a deal. When eventually he came upon this young man, saw him on a fiddle and playing on the The devil jumped up on the hickory stump and said, Boy, let me tell you what, in case you didn't know it, I'm a fiddle player too. And if you care, 
dig in there. I'll make a bet with you. The boy said, My name's Johnny, and it may be a sin, but I'll take your bet. You're going to regret, because I'm the best that's ever been. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, guys, just going to show you my pickups real quick. Uh, I got this from Dan, um, the Aliens Quadrilogy, with like director's cuts and all that, the whole thing. Shazam! Uh, thanks, Dan. That's awesome of you. He just picked up a uh, Blu-rays. Actually, I think in the last market video that uh, he was hunting with me. Um, he picked those up. All right. Mustangs. Those of you that know, I'm looking for them for an art project. We got two there. I got a bunch here. Let's see. It's not a Mustang, but maybe I can resell this. Johnny Lightning for Mustang, you know, to get a Mustang, whatever. This just looks like it's something good. 1977. Uh, this, I think it's Matchbox. Oh, it's just a whatever. It's good enough for my project. And this thing, which I'm suspecting might be worth something. It's a pretty cool little police car. Husky, I don't know, if you know what you're looking at, Buick Electra, I don't know, just a cool car, right? Uh, anything else in here? And this beat up GTO, uh, red line I suppose, what year is it? Yeah, S wait, that's 67? Nice, it is a red line. It's beat up, but who cares? People buy them to restore them. Check out uh, Bare Metal HW on YouTube. My favorite uh, Hobby of Restoration channel. Alright, uh, Dan also picked me up this, I guess at a thrift store. It's like a Ukraine scarf. I'm Ukrainian, so to me this is freaking awesome. I love it. Alright, so you guys saw the thing in the video. I have a shitload of these swords now. Gremlin here, Mecca. That was a book. Hollywood Squares. Everything I got here was five bucks for the whole thing, so. <clears throat> I traded some things to uh, Scottish Mike. Um, something from Micro Machines. I actually remember these stickers from my childhood. I'm gonna do uh, my sticker collection from when I was a kid. Um, I have an album. I used to collect stickers like in middle school. And I have this Batman one right here. But yeah. Never had the whole list and now I do. That was a part of this $4 lot. Uh, this pretty neat looking Tron bike. It lights up. I almost sold it to Mike, but I'm um, gonna save this for the toy show that me and Dave are gonna do. A little Playmobil, a little Pikachu action. Somebody tell me, let it go. Somebody tell me who that this is. I just thought it was a really cool sculpt and figure. As far as anything else, no idea. Looks like someone painted him. I don't know, who cares. So yeah, all this is four bucks. There's uh, these molds here. I don't know if they're worth anything, but they look pretty neat. 1965 Mattel. Oh yeah, these are worth something. They're Mattel. <laughs> cool. I didn't even know when I bought them because I paid like four or five bucks for them. So yeah. yeah some hot wheels down there. Uh, Dave says these might be something special. I don't know. Whatever, man. Oh yeah. This Chipmunks mobile. It's pretty cool, right? A uh, frisbee. This was in that box, so I don't even know what this is. 1,000 uh, trivia game. Ooh, Toys R Us. Cool. That's worth money. Uh, that's my pickup from like two weeks ago. I forgot them in my trunk. Just a bunch of cars. This I made. It's like a giant Zippo lighter, Metal Storm. It's cool, man. All right. Those are my pickups. That's it. I'm uh, packing up my car. I actually just walked up to my car and realized that I had it unlocked and inside I have like mother load of expensive pops and like all this stuff like I'm moving so 
Right now I'm gonna go drop this off at the new house that me and my girlfriend are moving to. And uh, I can't believe I didn't get robbed. I mean, jeez. There's probably like $800 worth of stuff in here. It's crazy. Nothing's missing. All right, I'm done, guys. Uh, see you all in the next episode, you know? Uh, don't forget to subscribe, dingle the bell. You know, whatever. Subscribe if you really like these videos because uh, I try to put the flea market videos once a week. So once a week flea market videos and when I have time I make like other videos about like toy reviews, Power Rangers stuff, vintage toys, you know, stuff like that. So if you're new to this channel, check out my playlists. There's a lot of variety and awesomeness if you're into nostalgia and 80s, 90s stuff. So, uh, but yeah. Alright guys, see you all in the next video. Later.